And speaking of shifting it, that's why you're here. I'm not just talking about in the lab, but it's probably why you're here too. Talking about the planet. We all incarnated at this time for such a time as this, because when you look outside, you turn on your television onto CNN, Fox News, you see everything going on. All the problems, the wars, the rumors of wars, the starvation, what's going on with the animals and the pestilence and the oceans. Oh boy, it is so easy to get overwhelmed, isn't it? And as empaths or highly sensitive people, if we're not managing our faculties in this way, we can be overwhelmed by the negative energy that we perceive in the world. But we came here for such a time as this. Can we very quickly remember what Jesus said about this? He said, and I paraphrase, if two people agree, their father in heaven, which is just to say source energy, must do it. If two agree, if you and I agree, source energy in heaven is compelled to move, is compelled to create, is compelled to act. And where two or more are gathered, there God is in the midst of them. And here we are gathered together. How many people we got? About 60 people. It's more than two. We are gathered and God is here in the midst of us. What are we going to do with all this power? What are we going to shift? Let's shift the patterns out of our life that no longer serve us. We don't need them. We release them. Thank you, God, in me. And so it is. What do we want to activate? I want to activate my full intuitive mainframe. All of the abilities that I've always had, but which may lie dormant now. I want to bring them back online, activate them so that I may use them to shine my light into this world to affect a change and a shift. And so it is brought back online. What do we want to agree upon? The healing. We need healing in the body, in the physical body. We've got limitations. Healing is possible. Healing is not only possible, it's not necessarily a miracle if you know how to align to the source of, of miracles, to the source of healing, and that's God. And so let's agree on the healing, whatever that healing is for you and for me. Let's agree on that. I agree on your wholeness. I agree on your unbrokenness and your fearlessness. I agree on your empowered spiritual person. I agree on this. I agree on your voice that you get to speak loudly, represent yourself as you truly are, not be meek and timid. You, and timid. you matter. Your voice matters. And I agree. I agree that you should speak and that you will and that you will move hearts and people. Yes. I agree that you can heal and that you can perceive and that you can see into the hearts of people and you can know where there's a, a wounding and an injury and a pain. And I agree that you can bring the healing there. You are so useful for such a time as this. You are so meaningful. Thank you for agreeing to be with us on this nutty planet. Thank you. Blessings to you. Hey, let's reward that spirit with some prosperity up in here. Let's reward that, reward that with some money. What's, what's wrong with money? It's good. It's neutral. It's just a tool. There's no reason we shouldn't prosper. Absolutely. Let's reward it with functionality, with opportunity, with networking. Let's reward it with people who show up on the scene to make it easier for us. Thank you, God and me, because all this is possible and more. If we just agree, I agree. Do you? If you do drop it in the comments, I agree. And if two of us agree, guess what? God is compelled to move. God is compelled to create. God is compelled to act on our behalf. Command you, me, what I would do with my hands. Command you, me, says God, what I would do. What do you want me to do? What are we creating? I agree with that for myself and for you, health and wellness. I want you to be happy. I want you to see yourself as source sees you, illumined being, a light, worthy to be here. You're so worthy to be here. Thank you for being here with me. We got this. We got this. Lift thine eyes. 
We are aliens. We are not of this world. We are a peculiar people in it, but not of it. Can you dig it? That's who we are. Let us walk around the planet being that. Let's walk around the planet vibrating with that. Let's walk around the planet being the blessing because we have come into this life to bless this life. There is no other reason for us to be here. And we wouldn't have come here if we couldn't do it. We didn't come here to get lost. We have a map. It's called our heart. The kingdom of heaven is within you. We have a compass. We have a toolbox. We've got everything. We've got each other. How about we just meet every now and again and agree on some stuff? Because I have so many things I want to agree on with you. Like the animals. Like the ocean. Like the food. Like the love. Like the acceptance. Like the oneness. Like the all. Like There's so many things that we could agree on. And let me remind you. What did we do when Australia needed us? We prayed. We agreed. We came together. And it was a lot of people, but compared to how many people are on the planet, it wasn't that many, but it didn't matter. We came together and we prayed. And guess what? It rained. And in some areas in Australia, it is still raining. That's me. That's you. That's what we can do. And that's what we ought to do. Because that's what we came here to do. Don't sell yourself short as a little light. Even if it is a little light, it's still a light. But let that light shine before men and women. Don't hide it under a bushel. Come on now. Let me see the color. Let me hear your voice. Let me see you move. What do you want to create? Powerful, manifester. Let's do this. Can I get an amen? And so it is. And so it is.